Kristen Stampini, Stamp TV Tuesday. What are we gonna be talking about today? Virtual assistants, of course. A day in the life of a virtual assistant. Here's an example today. So that's what I'm gonna give you. When a virtual assistant basically works for you in a day, what can you expect? Virtual assistant comes in, they can, if they're checking emails, they can check your emails to see if they need to respond to anybody or what is important. They should have a calendar every single day of things that they're gonna do daily, weekly, and monthly. So then they're gonna look at their daily calendar to see, or actually task calendar. And there's many, many, many different task uh, calendars or task uh, programs out there that you can use. Uh, you can use free, there are some free ones, there are some that you pay for, and that's completely up to you. Uh, so then they can look at that and see what do they need to do next. So for us, let's say it's a customer service virtual assistant, they're gonna be following up with all the people that it says that they are tagged to follow up with today. And then they're gonna look at all the people that they need to be emailing today, okay? They also are gonna be listening to, um, to voice messages, getting back to people. So what do they do? They have a specific job that they're gonna be doing every single day, week, month, and you gotta make sure that they're on task. Some of them with more detail, a virtual assistant, they're gonna automatically actually be on task, but other virtual assistants that are not detailed, they definitely need um, help if, 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 if they're in a different country, they need your help to help them set something up, especially if they're working for you part-time or full-time. Usually ones in, in the US is different, okay, but they do charge you know, four or five to 10 times more expensive than people that are out of the country. So you just have to make sure that every single day that you, that they know exactly what they should be doing and this should be taught in training. So make sure that your expectations and training and also I like to review things with them every single week. So for me, when they first start, the first 45 days, I'm talking to them every single day for maybe five or 10 minutes, at the beginning maybe 15 or 20 minutes. Then after that, it might be once a week. They're sending me their task report of exactly what they're gonna complete that day, then what they completed, questions they have. So every single day, there sh it should be where there's no problem on what virtual assistants should be doing for you, depending on what their job duty is. Hopefully you took a couple tips today, you follow me every single week, on YouTube, I also post daily content on uh, TikTok, so you can follow me there as well, Kristen Stampini. Thanks for joining me. Follow me, thumbs up. We'll see you next week. Bye.